Does anybody write any books and had to date a 20 year old millionaire that can do whatever the hell she wants whenever she wants? Does anybody have any books and had to do that? I would read it. Fucking living in my van. It hasn't started over a year. We're going on like a year and a half now. I just picked up extra work where I can work 60 hours a week. She asked me to compete on like Tinder, Bumble. I'm in the best shape of my life, which is one thing. I'm 32 years old. I look like I'm 25. Dating apps are definitely not, not my best option. I go on these dating apps. I'm in the best shape of my fucking life. I'm jacked out of my fucking mind. And I have pictures to show it. I go on these apps. They send me scraps. They send me scraps. Balloon scraps. Get the fuck out of my face. I work my ass off every day. I go to the gym every fucking day. I built a content machine for two to three years. I talk about these on these stupid dating apps. They still hand me balloon fucking scraps. Get out of my fucking face. This world is upside down. I have way better chance of meeting somebody in person. Plus, I go outside. I try to start my van to get some AC. There's a fucking wasp nest in my van. Sick. I get stung by a wasp. At the same time, I'm trying to compete with a 20-year-old billionaire who thinks that if I go on these dating apps, I mean, I would think I at least get, like, something relative to what I put out on the table, especially, like, that I show that I'm, like, literally in the best shape of my life, jacked out of my fucking mind, I've gone to the gym and worked out every day for, like, four, five months, we're probably going on, like, six months now, and then the reflection I get is, like, like, I just, like, sat in a fucking fast food place every day and eat fucking McDonald's. That's the reflection I get. What the fuck is wrong with you? This is why, like, I'm gonna go work out at the park, and I'm just gonna fucking read what energy I get, and when I have opportunities and options, when girls are drawn to me like they are in public now. In public, it's like, the attention I get in public versus what I just saw on these dating apps is, like, a complete fucking 180 world is fucked. There's a bunch of stuff that my new job gave out. I mean, it was in the bathroom. It's kind of cool. Little, like, hotel wash kit. This is better than, like, most wash kits you get at a hotel in your hotel room. You know, shaving cream razor. Toothbrush. <laughs> kind of ironic. My second day they gave this stuff out, but... I do appreciate it. I got one of these. Now I know where the... I went and picked up an order from Amazon like a year ago. And I must have... I don't think I smelled too good or something. I don't know. I was probably walking in like the heat. It's probably when it was the summer and it was 100. And the guy... It was definitely hot. It was definitely like the summer. And the dude was like being nice. And he was like, you want you want one of these? And he gave me like a wash kit. And he gave me two wash kits. And they were like really nice. And I still have, I still have both bags that they came in. Like, like legitimate like zipper case. Um, and the other one's like a fold up plastic case thing. Uh, but that's definitely where they came from. They definitely were just extras that they handed out to their workers. And I was like wondering why they had them.
I just broke it. Wow, I totally just broke it. Good morning. I'll take a combo with uh, coffee and a hash brown. A puppy? Yeah. 1016. 